This one getting off to a bit of a slow start for the second half. Sure made up for that. Avonworth putting in a full team effort, able to get the win here on homecoming night. Congrats to Hayes Robinson and Zoltan Edie, king and queen for the Lopes. Starting things off in the first quarter, West Mifflin would strike first. Quarterback Joseph Fleming would send this one deep to Tyrone Leonard, who would make the catch, setting up the Titans for this. The handoff to Delron White. He runs it in for the West Mifflin touchdown, breaking tackles left and right. 7-0 Titans. Later in the first, Lopes with the ball. Carson Bellinger with the handoff to powerhouse Nico Neal, who runs it in for the five-yard touchdown. All tied up at seven with 42 seconds left in the first. Second quarter now, Avonworth marching down the field as time ticks down. Bellinger, long pass, going to be intercepted by Titans quarterback Joseph Fleming. Avonworth leads 10-7 at the half. Things got interesting in the second half. Avonworth came out on fire. West Mifflin would fumble in the third. Avonworth recovered, rolled down at the 29-yard line. The very next play, it would be Andrew Cuban on the keeper. He runs it in for the 29-yard touchdown, 24-7, Avonworth. That would break the game wide open. The final of this one, 38-14, Avonworth. Here's head coach Duke John Cork after the win. Coach, slow start there in the first half, but the second half really things got rolling. What was the message to the team in the locker room there? Just come out and execute. We uh, we came out, we did, uh, we had a new set that we put in, um, and we ran it and it was successful. You know, so that's, that's you know, a benefit of deferring and getting the ball in the second half. Nico Neal also had some pretty big powerhouse runs there. Uh, what have you seen out of him as a player? Well, he's year? just been put in, you know, he's he's always been in the wings. You know, we have good backs and we know when we need something uh, good, he can he can deliver. He's a he's a powerful back, he's low to the ground, and he runs hard. He's a great running back. We have three or four really good running backs. Andrew Cuban also showing up. What does that say? So many guys on this team just being able to get this win done tonight, touchdowns. A lot of guys running it in there tonight. What does it say about this team? Yeah, you know, it's 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 a team thing. That's a, it, unselfish. That's what we preach all the time. It, you know, us is us, and you know, let's roll to the next week. Coach, congratulations. Thank you. Appreciate it. Avonworth coming up big tonight. Now staying perfect on the season at six and zero, plus getting one of their stars back in action. Reporting in Avonworth, Ashley Leotis for Operation Football.